This is Denise Davis, and we are entering the Nightmare Before Christmas collection room. To start with this cabinet here. At the very top are Jen Planning dolls. And inside this cabinet we have Disney Store and Disney Auction snow globes. And the snow globe here is the original snow globe, first one ever made for Nightmare Before Christmas. On this shelf, we have Disney Auction Snow Globes. Disney Auctions is no longer in existence. All their collectibles are limited edition. And their snow globes are known for their mini globes. These little figurines spread throughout are called Harmony Kingdom boxes. There are 14 Nightmare Before Christmas Harmony Kingdom boxes and I do own them all. They are made out of crushed marble and they have kind of a watercolor look. In this cabinet we have on top some picture frames and Hasbro Lock, Shock, and Barrel dolls. The top shelf are Jim Shore figurines. Jim Shore is a folk artist. And there's a mayor Jim Shore there. Some ornaments in the back that are Jim Shore. The rest on this shelf are busts. The Pumpkin King in the back and Sandy Claus in the back are Grand Jester Studios. And on this shelf we have some Olszewski collectibles. The uh, shadow boxes there light up and are called Gallery of Light. There's an heirloom box in the middle there and the dolls are Madame Alexander. And here we have some porcelain anniversary clocks and bronze paperweights on the end. And this purple collectible here is a jewelry box, one of my favorite collectibles. It's very highly detailed. On the bottom we have an Oogie Boogie David Krakow statue and a clown David Krakow statue. There's a Jen Planning Mare doll on the floor. Up on the wall we have some Jen Planning action figures. There's some more over here. And then we have an UNO game, Sally Bronze Mirror, a canvas art print, and here is a drawing that my husband did. He's an engineer. He does draw, drawing on the side. It's a, a hobby. He's very good at it. And here we have some puzzle pins.
And this one's Sally. Some bookends here. And inside the cabinet we have Nightmare Before Christmas Hawthorne Village Halloween Town Collection. There are 28 houses and 20 accessory sets. In the middle here is actually a Hawthorne Village tabletop sculpture. And up here is a billboard in the back. Right here is a store display where they would have sold VHS tapes on it. And the Jun Planning action figure on the floor. And here is a Sally big figure. Top this cabinet we have more Jun Planning dolls. Some picture frames. Pewter lamp. Got some plates on the wall. In this cabinet we have what's called WDCC, which is Walt Disney Classics Collection. These are very highly detailed porcelain figurines. The sleigh in the middle there is actually a Disney theme park exclusive. And so is the Santa Jack on the Angel here. Everything in here is WDCC. We got a Jack Big figure. Some stockings on the wall, a Jack Marionette. Some porcelain masks. We got a Christmas tree filled with Nightmare Before Christmas string lights and ornaments. Here's an ear hat ornament. It's made to look like an ear hat from the park. Here's another one. And another one. Your hat. There's a bobble ornament. The top pops open. This is a blown glass. Hallmark ornament. This is a Swarovski ornament. It's got Jack on the front, Sally on the back. And that is made of enamel and crystals. This ornament right here is my favorite from Disney Store. This ornament is made to look like a shoe with the Nightmare of Christmas theme. Kind of got a bone heel here. Here's the Sally Marionette. This right here is the 10th anniversary Jack stained glass lamp. We got some candle holders and candelabras. This is a NECA Tiffany lamp. On the top shelf, we have Hawthorne Village Nightmare of Christmas Christmas Town collection. I do have all six houses. Here's some Hallmark ornaments in the back on that ornament stand. This is a wooden music box. Very interesting piece there. Then on the shelf we have some busts and little figures and a candy dish in the middle. On the bottom we have some bookend snow globes and the Bone Deer snow globe in the middle there. I didn't have room in my snow globe cabinet. In the back is a Yahtzee game. Here we have a Jun Planning sleigh. On the floor in the back here are some dolls and bags. We have some posters on the wall. This poster here is, was for the 3D release to theaters. You see they have all their 3D glasses on. On this 
little nightstand here we have a desk lamp, a little tree, a calendar, and then these are knobs, now of Christmas. And then we got the seven foot posable jack. His joints move. You can pose him how you like. And you can see his joints actually move. And we have another marionette. On top here we have some storybook ornaments, a sand timer, and some tulip lamps. Got Sally there in the middle. In this cabinet, on the top shelf, we have a little jar in the back and some figurines and a desk set. You see a stapler, pencil holder, notepad holder. On this shelf, we got a jack bust in the corner and some little plates and figures. Here's a light up figurine in the back. That's a Santa Jack. Um, that is a pin box from Disney Parks. And here is the pin that goes inside. And there is another pin box. It's called a Mark Rita box. Mark Rita is the designer. There's another Mark Rita in the back there with a the zero pin. And these right here, this figure in the back, uh, middle here, and this one here, are from Kingdom Hearts. This is Sora from the game Kingdom Hearts when he goes to Halloween Town. We got Jen planning Jack and Tombstone. And on this shelf we have some champagne or wine glasses and some cookie jars. Here we have some mugs and clear paperweights and toothpick holders. And on this shelf, we have some candy dishes and cookie jars, some vinyl records in the back. This is the Treasure Craft cookie jar, it was the first one made. And then here we have some salt and pepper shakers. Then over here, we have a Halloween Town sign. And I put some decals on the side of my cabinets here. And then here we have a Sally quilt. On top we have the Nightmare Before Christmas Hawthorne Village train set. I do own all 12 pieces. It actually came with an entire track, but I didn't have room to set it up. And here we have some candles made to look like Nightmare characters. And over here, we have a chess set. I do own all 12 pieces. And down here in the corner is a Jack Medicom figure. It is supposed to be the same size as the puppet in the movie. And here he has some interchangeable heads. This big guy in the middle is a WDCC figurine. I could not fit it in my WDCC cabinet. The zero big figure. A model sheet from Disney Auctions. And back in the back is a mantle clock. Very highly detailed piece. One of my favorites. Here we have a collector's bust. There's the DVD inside here. In the back we have the 10th anniversary snow globe. And another snow globe. And here's a Medicom Santa Jack figure. Doll. Here is the A&W promotional pumpkin when it came out in 93. On the wall we have a cuckoo clock, license plate, a yo-yo, and some Hasbro action figures. And in here we got a mouse ear hat from Disney Parks and a blanket. And then over here, got a big figure, some pewter jewelry boxes, a gen planning figurine back there, one of my favorite pieces, a nutcracker, a Sally big figure from Disney Auctions, and she is limited to 250. These are garden statues, 
And we have some pewter candle holders. Uh, oogie boogie back there. We've got a trash can. In this cabinet we have on the top a Marehurst tin replica. It's made out of tin. We've got some figures and different things in there. And then I have some jewelry boxes and some figurines. These are our Hallmark Halloween ornaments on a Hallmark haunted house. And then here we got some bobbleheads and statues. This is a Sally Electric Tiki Animated Ladies statue, limited edition. And down here we have some dolls. Some are Jun Planning and some are some other brand. And that concludes my collection.